Hey, Don Copeland here again with the Compress UV printer. Today we're going to be doing some printing on the Compress UV 600S. All right, this is our smaller format machine. We also have a larger format 1200, but today we're just going to use a smaller machine to show you a little bit about printing on boxes, packaging, whether it's for prototyping, custom printing, or just, you know, all around application. We use, uh, we're actually going to print some boxes today that we use within our sister company to mail out to our customers when they buy a new machine that has, uh, used to just have a little sticker on it, which was kind of fun. We decided why not take it a step further and we created a actual box that is full print and uh, we'll show you actually what it's going to look like. It's pretty cool. Uh, we'll get it started printing here while we're going at it. This is actually a finished product. Imagine we had a sticker that set right here before, right? Which was cool, but now when you get it, look at this. Imagine the impact this can have on your customer, all right? When you send them something that has this kind of impact. Now, not every product you're going to have is going to have arms on it, like a t-shirt does, but being able to do full bleed, high impact type of packaging can be awesome. It also, you know, it, it, it could be something you're using if you're in a business that maybe does litho or other types of printing like that, you're trying to get approval for customers. This is a really quick way to do a really good mock-up, present different concepts, different ideas of how packaging is going to come out. So you wonder what this looks like if you're new to the packaging industry. Basically, the boxes come to you like this. All right? So we have these. This is actually got one of these. We taped it down a little bit. We got some wings that might pop up. We just taped it down with some, some light vinyl so that they don't pop up. We're printing straight onto that back, right here in the background even as I'm speaking. So uh, what's different about this type of printing if you're new to UV printing as opposed to other types of, of inkjet type of printing is that when we print with UV, the inks are immediately dried once they hit the surface. If you see these purple lights scanning back and forth, purple or blue, depends on what you're, what you're seeing with your eyes, these lights scanning back and forth, there's actually a light on each side of the head, but as it scans back and forth, it's drying that ink as it impacts. I, I can actually touch this right here. You can see there's no, no ink on my finger, so it's dried immediately. The benefit to that on something like this, and we're printing on a box, this is cardboard, right? Cardboard itself is going to be absorbent to ink. So if you, you were to print with a regular inkjet printer directly onto this, the ink would be wet, you get what's called a dot gain, all right? You're not going to get the sharp edges that you're able to get, which would, you know, which is not what we want. We want this to go, and we don't want to have to, to use a label, because then a label can go on crooked, right? The label is limited to, and with this type of material, by the way, if you got a really good label, you got one shot. <laughs> if not, you're going to damage the box, or you're just going to you're going to end up throwing the box away. What we'll actually do is after this, we're going to print the similar design but in the same size as, as a printed it instead of a decal. We're actually going to print it on a pre-assembled box. So I'm going to take a box and say we already had boxes that were pre-assembled. We'd actually print directly onto the box. Uh, we have a customer of ours that actually produces a product that they wanted to produce their own boxes. They weren't this type of cardboard. They're a higher grade type of cardboard like you would have for a gift box. And we actually were able to print their product, right? And then they dropped their product into the box and we absolutely exactly reproduced the product on the surface of the box as well. Double-edged sword. Because of the depth, we do print deeper than anybody on in the industry, we were able actually to turn the box on its side like this, put their website information, all the information right here on the sides of their pre-assembled box as well. Another benefit to having a, a UV printer, especially a really deep UV printer. Most of the markets that the printers on the market are going to be six inches or less. And I got news for you. That's more than six inches right there. You're going to be able to print right on that edge, which you wouldn't be able to do with the competition without disassembling this box. Another example, while this is printing, is I want to do gift boxes. This is a small gift box, all right? This is a pattern we printed right on that gift box. And we just laid this out, printed it, laid it right in the pattern. It could be, you know, this would be for your, your girly friends. And for the, the guy friends, you put a pocket knife in here, print it in camo. All right? And then one of the cool things that we, we've always done around here in the, uh, the Coleman companies is when we're, uh, we're using our new toys, I love my toys, right? And we try to make it practical for the business. Well, one of our businesses sells transfer paper for... Uh, for lasers, right? And instead of a sticker to put on here, just a small sticker in the corner, we print it straight on this box, all right? This is just a simple two-piece type of box right here. This is pretty similar to the type of box I was talking about at the customer's product where it was, uh, that we printed their, their design on it as well as the item that was on the inside. I would tell you what the item was on the inside, but I'm sworn to secrecy with the customer. 
So, we'll pull this off here and show you the product in its finished state. Alright, here we go. You can see I've got, I just used, this is just a little thin label right there to put, hold that on. Then we would just fold this up. Alright, there we go. And once you folded it up, bada bing, bada boom. This is why I'm not that guy <laughs> on the Domino's commercial <laughs> doing the pizza boxes. And you have a really unique product. I mean, I, I, I like to keep showing this off. I mean, how cool is that? You got wings. Hey, you sell dog biscuits? How cool would it be to have a basset hound with his ears flying off to the edges here, right, for your doggy biscuit? So, Don Copeland here, just got done showing off how to print custom prototype boxing packaging on your Compress UV 600, 1200S. It's a great extra market you can reach out to. In a lot of cases, you may actually be printing products. They're going in boxes for customers. It's going to allow you to customize those when you send them out as well. So, just another example of having faster, deeper, type of prints that you can get with the compressed machines that you can't get with other types of machines. Like I said, pre-assembled boxes, unassembled boxes, you can do it all.